ceremony um, I mentioned the other day that my sister um, I guess now I can say was in nursing school uh, she is done with nursing school now and so tonight we have her capping ceremony and then tomorrow evening somebody is swerving around the road they're either vlogging like I am and not looking or texting and not looking um, but so tonight we have her capping ceremony and tomorrow we have her actual graduation. Uh, John is working late tonight so he will not be able to make this ceremony but he um, is not working late tomorrow so he'll be able to attend the actual graduation. I'm really excited to see this ceremony. Um, I've been to one capping ceremony before when I was little. My brother was dating a girl who was in nursing school and we went to her uh, capping ceremony so I don't quite remember exactly what they're like um, but I'm very excited to see this um, big turning point happen in my little sister's life. She is definitely a lot braver than I am. I do not have the stomach <laughs> to um, do the work that she's going to do so like I said I'm very proud of her and very excited so I'll give you an update in a little bit. Bye. So the weather in North Carolina cannot decide what it wants to do. It's been way too hot for December lately, like in the 70s, and I've been sweating trying to wear normal winter clothes. Um, and then other days it's like 28 degrees and you're freezing, which I know 28 degrees is nothing compared to the weather that some of you are experiencing. But then today, now it's raining and just Anyone who lives in North Carolina knows that you can literally get all four seasons in one day. This morning it was sunshiny and a little bit cool and then it warmed up and it was hot and now it has gotten cooler again and it is raining. If it could just decide what it wants to do, that would be great. You're proud of Mags. Proud of Maggie. <laughs> Love you, Mags. <laughs>
it's great to see you all and your lights. Kind of takes me back a while. But truly, tonight is a culmination of, of your journey to becoming a nurse. And now we're at one of my favorite places in the world. Let's go get something to eat. Yeah, do that before like you're home or something. Patient and emergency care to adults, adolescents, and children with mental health and substance abuse issues. We're in the age of do it yourself health care. Tools such as apps can get patients more engaged in their own health care, and patients are becoming more active participants in their care and treatment. They're also more educated, much, much more educated. There was a time when a patient didn't dare tell a physician, or they thought their these candidates please rise. <laughs> By virtue of the authority vested in me, I hereby confer upon you the degree Associate of Science in Nursing with all the rights, privileges, and responsibilities pertaining to that degree. Catherine Stambrough. Janine Lorraine Terstrup. 
from the right to the left, signifying their entrance into the community of professionals who have earned this degree. Congratulations. <laughs> nice face. Oh god, right no. You're right with me out. You're right with me out. Alright, well, we've got everybody. It's about bedtime. It is past bedtime. I've had a good couple days of celebrating my sister. Yeah, Maggie. <laughs> yeah. And now it's time. Go to bed. Cool. I think we're actually going to be able to wrap up this vlog tonight without pulling out the iPhone. Uh huh. All right. Well, as always, subscribe if you liked it, um, and leave a comment down below if you want to. Say good night, right. Vino. We'll see you again soon. Say good night, Vino. Good night, Vino. Good night.